Hello everyone, I decided to make a short guide on how to install mods for DBFZ on PC. As you can see from this short clip, the mods are incredibly well done. However, note that if you plan on using mods, you will not be able to play against other players online due to having to disable easy anti-cheat. I believe you can play against other players that also have disabled anti-cheat just fine, but don't quote me on that. Installing mods is fairly simple. First, you'll want to go to a Dragon Ball Fighters folder located in Games, Steam Apps, Common, Dragon Ball Fighters. Then, you need to disable Easy Anti-Cheat. To do this, just head into the Easy Anti-Cheat folder, execute the Easy Anti-Cheat setup and then click Uninstall on the bottom left. If you want to reinstall it later, you just have to execute the program again and click Install. Now, move to the red folder, Binaries, Win64. There will be an executable named Red Win64 Shipping. You have to rename it to what is written on the screen, and keep the .exe of course. Note that you'll have to launch the game by clicking on the renamed executable instead of Steam. If you want to set it back to normal once you're done using mods, just rename it back to what it was originally. After this, go back to the Red folder and head into the Content folder, then Packs. You will have to create the mods folder in this place, and make sure to write it the exact same way. This is where you install the mods. You can see here that I have a few installed already. Finally, head to the fightersemods.com website and download whichever mod you want. Then unzip it inside of the mods folder you just created. There's usually instruction made by the mod creators under the pictures on the website if you forgot how to install it. If you want to remove a mod, all you have to do is delete the mods folder. There's plenty of good mods out there, especially stage and costume mods, so I recommend checking them out. All that's left to do is to launch the game through the red executable file, and that's it! Enjoy playing with mods! If you want to restore the game to normal so that you can play online again, all you need to do is reinstall Easy Anti Cheat and rename the red executable. You don't need to delete the mods folder. Thank you for watching, I hope you guys have as much fun as I did with mods. Jiren, I'm not gonna let you win. There is nothing to gain from losing. It would mean losing everything worthwhile.